All right, hey guys, welcome again to Fire Alarms and such, and this is Simplex 4010 Test 28. More chimes. So we're just gonna dive right in. Going down over here is my Spectronics SBNG-1 single action pull station. Going up is my Simplex 24 volt mechanical chime. Got a little ring. So that'll be going today on code three. Coming over here is my System Sensor Spectra Alert Advanced CH uh, CHSR, I believe the model is. This is my chime strobe, yes, yeah, CHSR. And it is hooked up to the MDLR3, so that will be on two wire audible silence. And this is doing code three chime. And this is one that I personally labeled as alert. And this is flashing at 75 candela. Coming down over here under the stop with the horn off is the Faraday F1 GT Chevron. And we'll be pulling that today. Coming up and around, we have the System Sensor SRL L Series Remote Strobe. This is flashing at 30 candela. Yes, it is. For a second, I thought that said 90, and that's not possible. So, this will be flashing at 30 candela. And then going down is the Simplex 20999754 Single Action T Bar Pull Station. And then everything over there is still the exact same. We might be pulling something over there today. Door holder is active and we will be solo testing the uh, heat smoke detector right there. And then I think we'll be doing one of the key switches today. So without further ado, let's begin. We'll start with this pulse station. All right, and then we can silence from the enunciator strobes continue to flash in unison since they are on that sync module. And then we can go ahead and reset the T-bar. And you gotta love when a point realarms as you are resetting it. So we will go ahead and let the panel reset. All the strobes continue to flash. One says fire, one says alert. And we wait. I do very much love that simplex mechanical chime. That's, that's one of my favorite devices I have and there's not a whole lot out there that run on 24 volt. A lot of them I found, they run on like 4.8 volts. So that was a really nice find I was able to get. We can go ahead and reset the door. Awesome. And let's pull the Spectronics pull. Here we go. We'll go ahead and silence from the panel. And while we are here, we can do the M1-7 key switch. I can get my detector key. And we can acknowledge and silence everything and the panel can begin to reset and strobes continue to flash in unison and it looks pretty nice. So we wait. So 
I'm firing away. 75 candela is bright. Oh my god, I never reset the pull station. That would be why it's not resetting. Yesterday was a whirlwind of a day, so apologize. Apologies. Oh my god. Once more, because now I can actually remember to reset a pull station. <sighs> I had a tornado warning yesterday, so that was an adventure in itself. And then, yeah, we had a tornado touchdown just south of here. So if anyone is in Shelby, Ohio, I hope y'all are okay, because that was a bad tornado that went through. And now that the door is reset, we can do the F1 GT Chevron. Here we go. So we're going to lift open the cover, and the horn should be off. And then we can pull down. can go ahead and let the panel reset. I got another big thing on the way that will hopefully tie in with my voice evacuation system. So look for a video about that. If I don't get it recorded today because I'll be in France until May, look for it in May. All depends on if I get it recorded today and if I do, I'll have it scheduled to go out. Um, I think this Saturday. So, let's go ahead and solo the smoke detector, shall we? Get our can of solo. And let's spray it. Hopefully that should be enough. So, that has been Simplex 4010 Test 28. More chimes. So, thank you guys for watching, and as always, have a wonderful day.